Mario is without a doubt one of the most iconic game characters, and Nintendo knows how to profit from it with regular releases and spin-offs. However, their last new mainline entry was almost five years ago. What's going on? Although Mario Odyssey is the most recent new Mario game, Nintendo's kept us satisfied with releases of their previous mainline titles, such as New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe, Super Mario 3D All-Stars, and most recently, 3D World plus Bowser's Fury. These are great. I love playing Mario Galaxy in HD, and playing 3D World wherever I want, but they're not new. The company must have been working on something new since Odyssey, so where is it? What will it be? It has to be close to announcement. Fortunately, there may be some clues to what it may be. Considering it's been a while, I think it's safe to say we should expect it soon, as in, within the next year or two. I think it's worth pointing out that the Mario movie is right around the corner, being slated for release next spring. I think it would be smart for Nintendo to release the game in a similar time frame to the movie. They could even have a tie-in with each other, thus potentially boosting each other's sales. The closest thing we've had to a new Mario game is Bowser's Fury, which was a new add-on to 3D World on the Switch. As far as Mario games go, it's actually quite unique. Currently, there are three styles of mainline Mario game. 2D games, like New Super Mario Bros. 3D games, like Mario Galaxy and Mario Odyssey. And 3D games in the formula of 2D games, such as 3D Land and World. When I say in the 2D formula, I mean they're 3D Mario games, but rather than being vast open world levels with multiple missions, it's more levels which are short and about getting from point A to point B. Bowser's Fury is unique in the sense that it's an open world like 3D Mario games, however it's done in quite a different way. Each level is a section within a much faster world, where rather than going to the hub world to travel to each one, you can actually travel from one to the other, in whichever order you want. It's a smart way of connecting everything into becoming a bigger, more open, open world. The reason I bring this up is because Bowser's Fury is odd. It feels like far too much to be just an add-on to 3D World, yet not enough to be its own game. My guess is that Nintendo is trying to test a new style of Mario game for potential future titles. This can give us a good idea of what to expect in the future. One question you may ask is, will the next Mario game be Odyssey 2? The easy answer is yes. It feels most likely out of all the other options. If this were true, they'd obviously expand upon the current world. I feel like it couldn't just be the levels from the first game, as it'd feel too samey. So maybe they'll introduce different parts of the same worlds, or even better, create brand new ones. It could also be a good chance to introduce the new style of open world that was in Bowser's Fury. However, I don't know if they want to save that for its own game. Side note, I'd love to see Mario Galaxy 3, but I'm not sure if it's very likely. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite Mario game is. An interesting topic to think about is a new 2D Mario game. Where is it? There hasn't been one since New Super Mario Bros. U on the Wii U. Has Nintendo given up on it? There's a few possibilities. One of them is that Nintendo's just taken a break from making them, which I mean, is fair enough because all of the New Super Mario Bros. games began to feel a bit repetitive. They could be taking this time to shake things up with the series. If they redo 2D Mario, much like they did from Super Mario World to New Super Mario Bros. DS, I'd be very happy. Another option is that they're using Mario Maker 2 as a new 2D Mario game, because the players basically make the levels for them. It also stays fresh because there's seemingly infinite levels made by creators, in ways that you just can't get in traditional 2D Mario games. Personally, however, I think this option is less likely. What do you think? We're definitely due at least one new Mario game. Now it's just a matter of when and what. I think it's safe to say that you can expect to see them soon enough, with some exciting new features to shake up the series, whether it be a 2D or a 3D game. Speaking of shaking up a series, watch this video to find out why Nintendo replaced the Miis in Switch Sports. Thanks for watching, and subscribe for more.